The neighbors who live next to 40,000 tons of coal ash want to make sure their water is safe. In a Channel 9 investigation, we told you recent construction in Hurricane Florence exposed coal ash that was used as filler near Lake Norman High School. Eyewitness News reporter Tina Terry went to that neighborhood on the other side of the school today and learned that Iredell County is helping with testing. Well, yeah, guys, this is not the only location where coal ash is buried in the county. In fact, leaders told me that there is more here than any other area in the entire state. Now they want to find out the impact that this has had on groundwater, and they'll conduct those tests next week. I know. I was shocked. I didn't know where it was or... What do we do about it? Karen Long's reaction after that Channel 9 investigation revealed 40,000 tons of coal ash next to her home and that it had been disturbed by construction and weather. Yeah, not great. <laughs> not too good. Now neighbors who want to know the impact all the coal ash has had on their well water are turning to the county. We have heard from some neighbors and they are looking to do some private water samples. And so what we have agreed is to mirror those water samples. County manager Beth Jones says a private company will take samples from about four homes in the area near Lake Norman High. The county will go in and take its own samples, sending them off to the state's lab. We're going to come in, collect samples at the exact same time and send those off to the state lab, compare the results to validate those results. We just don't know what the effects of coal ash are at this time. Commissioner Thomas Bowles says lots of coal ash has been used as structural fill in the county over the past 30 years, but those fields were authorized and inspected by the state. I think we have the most structural fields as any other area in the state. Yet. Now the neighbors have concerns about this site. Leaders say they want to do what they can to help. And the health of our citizens is not something that we take lightly. Oh, that's important. Yeah, that's important to have safe water yeah. for sure. Yeah, and even though all homeowners will not be conducting these tests, the information that comes forth could be very important to everyone in Ardell County. Reporting live tonight in the county, Tina Terry, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.